Hello and welcome to a new video about my stepper motor control. Well, it is still working. Yeah? However, I want to use I know, limit switches. Yeah? I want to move them to, to know where to start. Yeah? I want to have some switch where I go to and it, then that switch is touched. And I know, okay, I'm there where I think and then I can do my internal measurements and say, okay, I'm here. Good. Therefore, I need to read in limit switches. This board has the capability of limit switches and I know from the documentation that the X limit switch is on 9, Y on 10 and Z is on 11. I'm using X and Y so I should use 9 and 10 so that those two things fit. Okay, so I know the pin number. However, here is N switches X plus and X minus. You see it here? Here are the ports and there are end end stops and I, I intend to use them. End stops and there is always X plus and X minus. I want to learn what's the difference. Really want to learn what's the difference. Okay, to simulate the switches, I initially thought maybe I can use those things here. Yeah. However, now I realize why not use why not use those jumpers? Yeah. Here are jumpers. Why not use them? I will do that yeah. because I guess I have to connect only those boards. So get rid of this. Yeah, and use the jumper to see what is happening. All right. All right. So let's start on the computer to program a little. Okay. Okay. So at the computer, I will start immediately to define my analog input pins. Limit X, 9, it was 10 and 11. Even I, if I don't need Limit X, I will just make a printout. I will just make a printout and see if something is, is going on. So I will say, okay, here I need to, to say uh, pin mode. Limit X also interesting. I'm not sure if I use if I have to use input or input pull up. I will now use input because I think I read somewhere that there, there's an internal pull up resistor. Hmm. We will see. Okay, and here I will just say serial dot print line. Digital read and I will read limit, limit X. So I should see zeros coming right now. I should see zeros coming. Okay. Upload. Here I should see now the zeros appearing. Zero. All right. Let's see if this is still working. Power on. Yes, seems to work. This is jittery for whatever reason. Good. And now I say X limit minus. See what this means? Now go, go, hop, hop. Why can I hit it? Nothing. It means nothing. Is it still moving? Yes. Plus. Also nothing. Do I have to connect minus and plus this way? Also nothing. Do I have to connect this way? Also nothing. <laughs> no. Is this still 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 moving? Are we maybe a little bit too slow? 
something getting hot. Still lit, yes. Okay, maybe I have to use input pull up. Let's see if something else is working. Why? Also not. Also not. Also not. Hmm. What is this? Hmm. Not working. Hmm. There's one. No, it's one. Ah ha ha! Maybe it's just in some sort of buffer. Maybe I am displaying these ones too much. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. So I should not use this. Maybe I should use. Uh, unsigned long display equals millis should be static if millis minus display bigger than 1000 so every second should be sufficient then I will put this out and display equals millis. So I will now print it out only. Here I have added those lines. I will now print it out only after one one second. Uh, upload. Zero, zero, zero. Good. Let's see if I now connect X minus nothing. If I now connect X plus nothing. If I now connect X plus and minus nothing. Ah, so connect those two. Sometimes I have a one. Hmm. Maybe I should use. Maybe I should use input puller. Who knows? Maybe this comment meant I should use pull up. Upload. One. It's now one. It's clear because I used pull up. Now I connect those two. Okay. Now it's zero. Remove it. Now it's one. Good. So X minus is working. Is this still? No. Still working. And what will do X plus? X plus. Hmm. Will stay? Oh, it's also zero. Yes. Okay. So X plus and X minus are just two limit switches I could use. Okay, so and then I have to distinguish whether I moved in one direction or the other direction. Good, so those, these are, these are now the limit switches. So we have to use input pull up and then if we connect those, it's working. Good, good, good to know. Yeah. So I will, and this is not, it's never limiting. This has to be done in software, yeah, this limiting factor. So actually, I think that's it, what I tried to find out today, so that we have this pin mode, so then we can read the, the switches in. Let's try also the limit Y, if this is working the same way, upload. Ones are coming, and here I connect the wire Switch to zero. It's good. And also the X. 
switch over to zero. So y plus and minus are working exactly the same way like x. Z will also work the same way. I'm pretty sure about this. Good. So we can start to use it. Can start to use it. I will do this in next video. Okay, I will do this in next video because I want to, to code a little bit something. I want this to move in one direction until we reach the, the limit switch and then we will move to a default position. Okay. Good. Yeah. So for this time we found out how these these inputs are working. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.